Hello friends, this is Normal here for Technique and in this video we will share some of the tips and tricks you can try out on the Oppo F3 with Color OS. So this phone comes with Android 6.0 Marshmallow along with that it has this custom UI called the Color OS. So in this video we will share some simple tips and tricks uh, available in this UI. So these are not hidden features, uh, uh, they are available in this uh, UI but we will just share some tips and tricks. So uh, let's get started and you can just go to the settings panel and here we can see the notification and status bar. So just select notification and status bar and you can enable the battery percentage and also uh, show the real time network speed and the carrier information. So these can be enabled from here. Then uh, going down you can also enable uh, easy light flashes upon receiving receiving notification so uh, the uh, the notification led can be enabled from here in case you receive notifications next step let's go to the display and brightness so here there is one important feature that's called eye protection display so this is basically uh, a display which uh, makes the strain in your eyes while uh, watching uh, videos or reading to text that will be reduced uh, so eye protection display you can see uh, uh, when uh, when you are uh, watching videos or reading content for a long time the eye eyes get strained and and this feature uh, enables you to reduce the strain in the eye so you can have a low medium or a high uh, in the eye protection level so you can just see that we have enabled high protection uh, i mean high mode in uh, the uh, eye protection display so there is also medium mode and uh, low mode as well you can just turn it off when you are not needing this feature Next up, let's go to the lock screen and magazine wallpaper. So this is one uh, a useful feature if you're looking for great wallpapers in the lock screen. So you can just enable this and you can add your own photos that those photos will be available. And you can also subscribe to different channels uh, based on your preferences. So uh, these wallpapers will be available in the lock screen. So that's another useful feature if you're looking for more customization. Now let's go to the sound and vibrate. So here, uh, if you scroll down, you can see the real sound technology available. So uh, what it does is it improves the sound performance and th this is one really good option uh, if you're looking for listening to music on the Oppo F3. So you can just enable this once you've connected the earphones and this produces some really good sound technology and HD sound is what Oppo claims. So that's another useful feature. Now let's go to the fingerprint and passcode. So in the fingerprint and passcode, we have uh, some additional options like uh, uh, fingerprints can be used to unlock the phone. That's a default option. Then you can also use for app encryption and file save. So we'll just show you that uh, once the uh, app uh, encryption is enabled, you can uh, you can uh, see which all apps uh, you want uh, uh, to uh, lock using the fingerprint scanner. And say for example, we have locked the photos app. So you can see that you can either uh, need to input your fingerprint or do draw a pattern before you access the photos because that app is encrypted so you can uh, encrypt apps uh, using the fingerprint scanner so that's one useful feature then let's go to the next option the gestures and motion so just as uh, we have screen of gestures quick gestures smart call and prevent misoperation so prevent misoperation is um, pocket prevent uh, pocket dial uh, prevention mode basically it will prevent uh, any dialing when the phone is in the pocket then screen of gestures there are some uh, really good options like double tap on the fingerprint button to turn on the screen double tap to turn on the screen draw o to go to the camera draw v to turn on the flashlight then music controls screen of gestures can be uh, enabled so these are really good options if you want uh, quicker access to features and options in the device then uh, there is also quick gestures included just a screenshot is there swipe with three, three fingers up or down to quickly take a screenshot uh, then the one handed operation is also included so there you go uh, three uh, finger swipe uh, to take a, a screenshot then one handed operation is also there swipe from the bottom left or bottom right corner towards the center of the screen so one handed mode again uh, reduces the screen size so you can just swipe from one corner or uh, you can just uh, uh, swipe from the other corner uh, to enable the one-handed UI. That's, that's again a useful feature. Then there is also a smart call option. So you can see auto answer when placed close to the ear, switch to speaker for calls. Uh, so similarly, uh, some useful options in the calls as well. So next up, there is an option called clone apps. So this is a new feature uh, in the color OS. So what you can do is you can uh, have dual instances of uh, some of the social networking apps. So uh, since we have installed WhatsApp, you can see you can clone WhatsApp. So just select WhatsApp and enable cloning and you can see renamed clone app. So right now the cloned app is called WhatsApp clone and you can uh, have your own renamed one and you can see uh, right now we have one WhatsApp here and another clone app here. So that's a new 
useful feature to clone apps so you can uh, do with other social networking apps as well right now we have installed only whatsapp then if you go to the additional settings you can see there is an option to enable the otg connection so if you want to connect your computer peripherals like keyboard mouse or pen drive you need to enable this otg connection so these are some of the useful tips and tricks you can try out on the oppo f3 with the color os hope this video was useful if you have the oppo f3 and the color os with you and uh, you can uh, try out uh, these features on your device and get the better out of your device so that's all guys thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video do, do hit the like button and also hit the red subscribe button for more videos thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video have a great day